the kiddos up for a brief message. I got Levi and Forrest here this evening at least. I don't see anybody else. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, is it Jalen? Jayla. Okay, I was close. Give me a little credit. <laughs> Hi, guys. Did you guys meet Jayla? This is Jayla. Okay. It's good to have all of you here. Has, Matt, let me ask you, has, has there ever been something that happened that you didn't like? Like maybe you got hurt or the phone rang in the middle of church? <laughs> it's okay. If it's for me, tell them I'm busy. <laughs> but have you ever gotten hurt and, and it just seems like, like I mean, you, everything else goes out of your mind. You're just thinking about your, your knee or, or maybe your mom or dad had you do something and you just, you, when, when something bad happens in our life, we just kind of lose our mind and we think that nothing else matters. But you know what? God gave you your moms and dads to help you, especially in those situations, especially when you're hurt, so that they can comfort you, so that they can give you hugs, and so that they can help you to know that, that this is going to be okay, that it's going to get better. And the truth is, I, I wish I could tell you that when you get old enough, things stop hurting. But that's <laughs> not the truth. Things, in fact, as some of us know, when you get older, um, things continue to hurt a lot. But, but you don't, it's not just physical hurts. Sometimes in life there are other hurts in our, in our lives that we don't like, but we can always turn to God. Your moms and your dads may not always be there for you, but God is always there for you. And, and God sometimes just, he sends our moms and our dads so that we can just know that he loves us. So this week, what I want you to do is I want you to ask your parents about a time that they were, that they were hurt, that they had something bad happen to them, but they trusted in Jesus, and that helped them to get through that time, okay? So let's take a moment and pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for your love for us. We thank you that, uh, that, that you never leave us, that you're always there to comfort us when we're hurt. We thank you for giving us moms and dads so that we can have real physical hugs, and those hugs are really from you. Thank you for your love for us. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. All right, guys and gal, you may return to your seat.